Well, President Trump just rolled out a plan to go after the cartels, and I think he's absolutely right. The cartels are running our border. Which is the stunning. The cartels are destabilizing uh, our neighbor, the entire Mexican government. We need to go on offense uh, against them. I plan to introduce legislation uh, to authorize the use of military force against these cartels. Look, Maria, they're defeating the Mexican army. This is a para, these are paramilitary entities with billions and billions at their disposal. Look how they just shot out, shot up the Mexican prison. How many right. of those inmates were let out, and how many are in and America then they right sent, now? The Mexican army sent battalions against them. They killed over, uh, killed or wounded over 50 Mexican soldiers. Uh, I, and I want to be clear: I'm not talking about U.S. troops, but I'm talking about cyber, drones, intelligence assets, naval assets. We've done this before. You remember back in the 80s when the cartels in Colombia were shooting down planes, killing members of Congress, about to take over the entire Colombian government. We had planned Colombia then. We had special operators yeah. training, not in combat, but providing those military assets that we need because these are paramilitary entities. Well, it's good that you say this because I'm, I understand it that these uh, cartels have very sophisticated weaponry. These are like massive military groups. That's right. Groups. Heavy machine guns, yeah. armored vehicles. Again, they are, they are fighting the entire Mexican army to a standstill right now. We need to support them with our military assets, and I want to authorize that. Well, 